So I have a problem in Rogue Tower. My problem is that I constantly run out of mana and build too big of a base without protecting my lines. We're gonna fix that today by doing the single defense. And there's our dumb little tower. Actually, not that good of a start, but I'm gonna surround all of these guys with those things, whatever those are called. And then we're gonna expand. So my little ballistas destroy the little goblins and we get cool things. One good thing to start off with is banditry because it gives us more money. Everybody likes more money. Unless you're one of those weirdos who doesn't like more money for some reason. You're like, nah, I prefer to be poor. But that's not the fun thing to do in video games. I just like exploding these guys and letting money fly out of them cool. I wouldn't mind starting with a shredder too. Like that's pretty powerful to begin with. So let's plop in a shredder like right here. This could be very deadly for these little goblins. Let's watch it destroy every single one of them. Aw, except for you. I'm gonna name him Carl. I don't like Carl very much. He's dead. And this is cool. We get the flamethrower already. So speaking of mana, now would be a good time to actually put that flamethrower in. That's pretty satisfying, cooking them like uh, George Foreman grilled. Do those still exist? Like, I don't remember those from back in the 90s. Ooh, the poison sprayer right away too, beautiful. We don't particularly need that, but the damage over time is quite nice. It might've been a bad spot to put this too. Eh, it's okay, especially in conjunction with our shredder. Quality over quantity, we'll get that crit chance rolling. I'm excited about this too, because, oh, this is dirty right through here. And all of these mana crystals. Okay, we're gonna get a poison sprayer and let's do a flamethrower here too. I wouldn't mind selling this one. Someone's yelling at me in the comments like, Blitz, why did you sell it? You're so dumb. I hate it when you play this game. Trust me, bro. I've read all the comments, but I am kind of excited about this. All right, we're gonna get some more mana happening here. Sorcery. Now let's see. Oh, I love this setup. This is so good. Let's get another shredder. Oh my goodness. Why do we need another one when that one works so well? Hot dang. And then this one can attack over there too. That is so strong. I bet if I put some stuff up here, it would work. I feel like mortars might be a good start, but the frost tower is going to be good. Now let's just try this for science. My goodness. That's going to be huge. Okay, let's get another one up here and then we can slow both. Ooh, that's not going to work well. It's not high enough. So that is level two. I'm going to demolish it. We're going to put a frost keep here. And then I'm going to put a poison sprayer next to it somewhere like that. And that's a good spot too. expand. Oh, dirty. These little ballistas are going to be able to do the work. All right, friend, I need you to start upgrading some. Uh, I want you to be on like most health and then we're going to upgrade you on health a little. Oh, and the mana bank is already, but let's go with the life steal because that should regen us faster at early stages of the game. My goodness, I was not expecting this. Bunch of free kills here. This is amazing. Wouldn't it be cool if it like circled back and went back this way? And these things are dying even without getting to our towers. That's great. I'm sure that'll be a weakness I have in the future. Ooh, the obelisk, no way. Oh, I love the obelisk. Do I do obelisk or bandits? All right, we're gonna go banditry. More money early game is better than more power early game. Flamethrower here. It's a pretty good spot for a flamethrower if I were to ask myself. Kind of hits everything on the way going through there. Beautiful. I wouldn't mind getting a shredder in here too, but I don't have money for it. If I get that one, Hmm, or this one. We'll do the mana regen. This one's good and is kind of rare. There are quite a few trees here. Let's get it now. All right, we got our first we got our first cross in the matrix here. I should probably build up this area as a fortified base. My goodness, this is strong too. Like a frost keep up here, just to slow everything down that comes into that cell. This is working really good through there. Oh, more sorcery. Oh, double chance for tree cards. Yes, I'll do that. Okay. Poison sprayer. Like, I want stuff around here. So let's get a flamethrower and a poison sprayer. And by a poison sprayer, I totally mean a ballista. Aha. Uh -huh. This will work pretty well. Maybe. Okay, it's not working as well as I had hoped. That is a lot of armor damage, too. We got to pay attention to this. But I'm feeling confident. I'm feeling like we can take care of this. Especially with all those ballistas working so well. My biggest concern is these giant guys here. But if I tell these to focus on armor and then upgrade the armor a little bit, that could work out okay. Oh, it'll work out just fine. I don't know what I was concerned about. Everything dead. Okay, mana bank. Do I need that yet? Yeah, I'm out of mana already. Those aren't great to begin with though. Particle cannon could be fun. Should we get a particle cannon? I kind of want to. It's expensive though. Oh, interesting. I really like this layout of today's tiles like i can build up lots of things right through here and attack both ways i can also build a particle cannon i think the radius for this thing is gigantic it is <laughs> all right we're totally gonna focus on most health i don't even know is it firing are you okay what is that charge up time does it not know how to fire 
I've never really used one of these. I think I've spawned them once on my maps. That was totally not as exciting as I wanted. All right, we're gonna get an obelisk. We are gonna run, yeah, that's a thousand gold again. Okay. This is a strong unit. Uh, progress, should I go <sighs> most health? I feel like progress might be the best, but also like, I wish there was a furthest from furthest. Yeah, we'll just do progress. I can't word sometimes, leave me alone. My furthest from furthest. Also, I'm out of mana. Like I've got no mana. This is great. Great way to start. That's why the particle cannon wasn't working too, I bet. Now, let's just delete this. Give me money back from other things like saws and ballistas. Even without any mana, we still beat the level and we didn't get anything. This is rough. Okay, this is really rough. We didn't get anything to attack Oogie. Who's coming out next? The first boss. All right, we're gonna take a lookout tower because you guys said it's good. And I don't even know where to put one. I don't know what the range is. It's not a great range. Let's try one closer in here. Okay, and now we're gonna have that mark the thing with the most health. Oogie should be coming. There's an Oogie. So Oogie will get in range and it'll get marked. I am glad that we're killing everything else, but Oogie has hardly taken any damage yet. So he's gonna get the full on yikes. Okay, he's taking a little damage. This is fine. As long as we can take him out with other things, I really need mana. Okay, he's half health and bleeding. So we have that going for us. Okay, the little bit of mana we do have is melting him. He's got bleed damage, fire damage, and poison, and getting attacked slowly but surely with zero mana. Oh my goodness. I was really gonna take this and sell all the trees to hopefully get more upgrades, but I think we're okay. Please. Please, please be okay. And you, sir, are gonna be dead in a second. Please, just be dead. Be dead. Oh yeah, saw blades will do it. There we go, sorcery. We'll get some of that. That'll help out mana a little bit. Also, I totally wanna know what's in the treasure chest. Yes, mana siphons, that's what we need. Oh, uh, we only got one. All right, so let's waste all of our money. Money, money, money. Buying all of the mana siphons we can afford. Beautiful. All right, so we're at uh, 27 per second. That should help out in our quest of dominance. Ooh, also look at these, grave sites. We kill creatures, Blitz gets more more mana parts. Ooh, just keep killing, just keep killing, give me more mana. I like my song, I just made it up. Oh neat, I beat the level. Um, We're gonna need Tesla pretty soon. That also requires more mana. So let's do the anti-magic ray and then just cross our fingers and hope that we can kill Yaga Baba here. Come on, death ray. My goodness. All right. We do get the kill pretty easily, actually. Give me some sweet treasure, more sorcery, absolutely. And everything is dying pretty easily, except for this guy, because, well, we haven't targeted him yet. But now we did, and he's disappearing. Great. Okay, thermal detonation, call airstrikes, monster watch. Hmm. All lookouts gain damage. Do they do damage? I'm not sure. Let's do shredders, more bleed. Because shredders have been working good for us. I'll put another shredder in right in here, I think. And I wouldn't mind having one over here if I can afford it. Nine. Yep, we can. Okay, we do need to upgrade our stuff pretty soon too. So let's see what we can do. I kind of want to put a frost keep in here too to slow things down as they come in. Let's make sure we get all of the shields disappearing. Good. Excellent, very nice. That slow works well. Okay, someone tried to make it through. Not a fan of that. Mana production is going well. I need to spend more money on the mana. And now if I look properly, I believe we have every mana area covered. Oh neat, we beat the level two. All right, death and taxes. That sounds good. There's plenty of these over here. Let's build up some of this. Oh, that's not good. All right, we got another boss. This squeaker's coming in hot. Squeaker's about to get obliterated by a death lady. Death Ray. Yep, he gone. Uh, let's do slow but sure. And I think I should probably reinforce throughout here a little bit more. I like what's happening here, but let's get a poison sprayer up on top of here, a frost keep up on here, and a flamethrower too, if I could afford a flamethrower. Why can't I never afford the fun things? Give me a flamethrower. Okay, everything died yet again, nor is everything is in the process of dying. Excellent. What do I need now? I wouldn't mind having that mana bank, but anti-magic ray would be cool, especially if I start leveling this up. We have 500 money. Let's just hit it. Let's get everything kind of equalized. And which way do I want to go? Let's expand here. I wouldn't mind having this split and this one just stay as is. For some reason, I have a hard time believing that we're already on level 20. This is going way too well. That's the famous last words all the time though, right? This station's doing pretty well. I wouldn't mind having an obelisk over here, but that eats up an enormous amount of electricity again. And by electricity, you mean mana. Too bad, I'm going to do it anyway. 
Oh, because we're going to get a mana bank. Now I'm going to start putting these in. What this does increases our max, and then we get 6% per kill, or 6% per second. So the more of this I have, the more mana regen I get every second. Okay, we're going to keep going over here. We get another boss in. That should be nice. We're going to do some level ups pretty soon. I wouldn't mind having another frost keep over here just to slow people down. I'm going to totally change this guy over to most health. Because we want this to weaken them up so they can go into this one and just get obliterated. Just like so. Very good. Nice boss kill. Proud of that one. Yeah, this is going really well here too. We got a nice slowing area, lots of money. Okay, uh, poison. Let's keep getting the poison. Hmm, po more poison damage on the death ray. We'll do that. And then we'll buy some more haunted houses. Oh, this is beautiful too. We're getting, so oh, if it would've kept going that way, that would've been awesome, but it didn't. This seems to be working okay back here. I've got everything slowing it down. Plus we're just nuking this back line, which is softening everything up to come into here. I kind of like that. Mana production still seems good, but I do want to add a few more banks in. I would rather get more money right now. Thankfully, there are a few more of these. Hello, more more mana. Ooh, look at this. I can make another one here. That's actually worth it. Get a poison sprayer and a flamethrower. Add another frost keep to slow things down. Just like a few of these stations throughout, just to keep the damage up. This is actually kind of scary that we have this thing that's gone so far. But the mana supply is going well. I'm excited for that. Things seem to be dying fairly quickly. I need a potion sprayer here. I don't see one. Maybe it'd be better if I had it here. Let's delete you and put you here. I need one along this path too. Jack Pumpington's about ready to die. Good. All right, we got to keep those damage over times up. Ah, Jack died. Poor fella. Cool. That worked super well. All right. Poison damage. Dobelisks expanding here again. Getting even more haunted houses. We're going to start rolling in the, the big money here pretty soon. I would like another another obelisk here too, but I think we need more mana. Okay, 60 mana per second. It's looking good. I've got another station that I built here just to slow things down. So they'll come in around. I do like the idea of having another like shredder in here just to keep up all the damage over time. Uh, mana da Ooh, Tesla coil, I forgot about you. Yeah, let's just use up all of our mana at once. Right, guys? All right, I'm gonna keep expanding uh, just for that reason. We got a little beaver. This isn't Timberborn, old Harambe or whatever your name is. My goodness, I need a lookout for here too. We'll try that to do the most health. So I'll just mark them, yeah. That would have worked. That's actually not a bad strategy over here. If we tell this to go to progress, let's see. Some of these are going to make it through. We can go to the marked. So then if they get marked, then immediately we do that. And this thing marks the one with the most health. That's not a bad strategy at all. I'm feeling like we do need another kill station further up as well. Or maybe back further on this path. But nothing makes it through and we still get treasure. So I'm cool with that. Oh yeah, death rate increase. Oh nice, two of them. Uh, lookouts get damage to shields. S sure. Oh, wow. Lifesteal, too. Beautiful. Okay, now we can start cutting down some trees as well. Oh, yeah. More lifesteal. Even better. Oh, but plus one range. You guys said that this is like the best upgrade in the game. So let's get some mana siphons on that one because we still can. That one's all cluttered up. Yeah, these things are not leveled up very well. So let's give a couple points. Level one marked. Let's go to shield damage. Okay, so I spent all my money on upgrades. Try to get as much as I could to level five. I should, after this level, you'll have to remind me. And by remind me, I'm just gonna try to remind myself because this isn't a live stream. I want to upgrade, or I want to sell all the trees on the map. It should give us lots of money. Yikes, we need a flamethrower here. And then we're gonna have this flamethrower work with most armor. Cause like, there's a lot of armor that's getting through right now. Wow. That's a lot of armor getting through, my goodness. But thankfully we do have quite a few things back here that should be able to rip them apart pretty quickly. But the problem is my mana is dropping down to zero again. So that's cool. And that little dingus actually made it. Wow, I'm proud of you little dingus. Nothing's making it through this way though, cause this is a majorly nasty death corridor. Okay, savings account, more mana. Let's spend our 2,700 building these up. And I think we just single-handedly doubled our mana plus a lot of recharge. That was great. Oh, and this circles back, no way. Yeah. We can also afford a few more of these and another couple of those. This is working way better over here after I leveled everything up. Plus our mana supply is in a great position. That works so well. Um, bleed them dry. Let's do the increase per second. 
and circle back a little bit. This is going to be huge. If this comes back two more, that's awesome. I need to do something like get a stupid particle cannon in or, you know, a bunch more mana banks because that's what I'm focusing this video on, an unlimited mana supply. Although I do not really want to drain out all of my resources for mana, but having a giant supply that I never run out is going to be a cool idea. And I wanted to sell the trees, but I forgot to again. So please kill everything. Oh, there's wheelie balls coming through. What are you doing here? Why are you so fast in junk? All right, stupid wheels. That's one of the problems I have is those, um, the wheels and the polygon things that break down, especially over on this path. I need more things in here that I can kill. Uh, also, I need to put something in between those. Let's do a frost tower up here. Damage to shields. That sounds cool. Frost tower is slow as well. Poison sprayer. Let's do a Tesla coil. Let's do a flamethrower. Okay, I'm, I'm scared to expand that one. So I just want to keep going here. This is incredible. I wasn't expecting this to happen. So like we can attack this wall. All right, let's see what this does. My oh my. Okay, it slows it down pretty well. Wheelie the Healy and it's dead. That worked well. Over here, we have more wheels. Are they coming through? Yeah, they're zooming. They zooming. I kind of want some more frost keeps right through here just to slow this whole thing down. I don't want things to get through, and this is one of our better death chambers. That's a bad position. All right, everything's dead there. This is working good down here. Our mana supply is still at 123, so that's solid. We're going to be at level 30, so I think that's a big boss wave. But the good thing is I should be able to attack everything over there with a few of these, so I'm cool with that. All right, banditry. That's more money. That's also very scary. Let's do money. This is awesome. This is so cool that I can reach over there, especially if I put up a bunch of ballistas on here that'll just damage over time. I'm still feeling very confident on this path. I think it's doing pretty well. Things are trying to make it through. We are killing them with great impunity. Is that the right word? Did I use the big word properly? I might have. Impunity. Okay, Google, what does the word impunity mean? Here's the definition. Uh -huh. Impunity, exemption from punishment, yeah. freedom from the injurious consequence Wait. of an action. I think that was backwards. Did I, did I do it backwards? I might have said impunity backwards. Unimpunity. Is that a right word? Would you guys die? Thank you. You have to ask nicely sometimes. All right, magnetic blades, damage to shields, damage to armor. That's what I want right now. Hey, okay, do I continue over here? I like what's happening here and I'm scared to mess something up. Ooh, I didn't even notice. I could do haunted houses over here. Okay, I'm just gonna keep expanding this route. Oh, hello. Let me get a mana siphon on you. Oh, nice. You guys told me these shrines are like the best thing in the game. The best thing since the sliced bread or shredders that slice through goblins. Okay, I am gonna upgrade. I think after this round, we're gonna upgrade everything that I can again, because I'm feeling a little bit weak. Actually, you know what? I just wanna keep it even. Mana supply is doing good even with everything here. So that means I can increase my mana even more. Things are dying, but it's kind of slow. I'm gonna put in a particle cannon Ooh. just because I want to. And it's gonna be between both houses, so I'm gonna get money from it, right? Is that how this works? Also, I entirely forgot to sell my trees again. All of them, every tree I forgot to sell, mainly because of incompetence. Also, ooh, there it is. There's the university. That's the thing you guys told me to buy. All right, we're gonna put one down here. Uh-huh, and then you can research all these different things, which upgrades all of the stuff. But let's see if there's any trees to sell. Sell. Ah, 62% chance to drop cards. I'm not seeing any cards, but I am getting a thousand. There's a card. All right, damage to armor. Yep, kill it with fire. Another tree, chop it. Treasure, more bleed damage. Hmm. Yep, more crit against bleeding. There's one more tree and another treasure chest. Radar, creeping cough. <gasps> Slows them by 5%. Yep, we want slow. Any other trees? I have sold every one of them. Much like the people who lived on Easter Island, which is one of the saddest stories. And check that out. There's a magical treasure box right here. What are you doing here, friend? Ooh, but lifesteal, delicious. Okay. Wow. Oh, wow. Look at all that money that just came in. How did we just get 13,000 gold? I'm not sure, but I need to upgrade this all of the way in the future. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, are we getting all of the bad things now? There's more wheels. I also want to upgrade you because you're doing the absolute, like, amazing amount of work. Might as well drop all my cards right into here. Level 21. Getting slowing down, getting some bleed happening would be awesome too. Oh, the bro is firing the missiles now. I feel like my voice just cracked. Wow. 14 again. Maybe it's because I've been talking for 40 minutes and I haven't been drinking any water. This is looking really nice through here. I like what's happened. I do want to upgrade you a little bit more to target most health. 
And let's hit you a couple times. That's a uh, saw blade. Death rate by 10%. Yep, I still haven't seen this thing work. It's had to have killed something because it's level two. 12 rounds per minute. Do I keep it? Let's sell it. It's dumb. Buy one of these instead. <laughs> That's not dumb. And it should target marked. I feel like it's going to target the shields most. I just put it up to 15. That might have been dumb. All right, shields for you, armor for you. There's another university. Let's put this in right next to it. I'm just going to spam all my money right here. Oh, it does global health if it ever gets money. Okay, I see what it did. I'm not as dumb as I look, hmm. I promise. This is very dangerous over here, though. But I feel like that second death ray has done a really good job. Plus our mana store is still like super good. So I'm cool right now a little bit. I do want to build up more uh, more mana banks as soon as I can. Okay, that second death ray being a level 15 is solid, especially when this one's 21. This boy over here has been doing a lot of work as well. What level this guy turn out to be? Five. Okay, we need to upgrade him. Two to armor. I want that. I need to upgrade you, friend. What do you need? You're at most health. I should feel like you should be on progress. I'll just level everything up to 13 and call it good. And it'll just make you on progress. Oh, and there's a treasure box hiding back here. Woo! How did I not see that? Let's do damage to armor. Ah, I was hoping for another one. Oh, well. Okay, continue on. I'm watching my mana supply very carefully. It seems okay. It looks fine. Nothing is making it too far in here. Poison slowing it down. Okay, something just almost made it past. It looks good to me. Mana is still way good. All right. Dude, this is such a nightmare back here for everyone. I just want to make sure they all have damage over time on them so they don't regenerate health. That's why I have all these little stations set up. Kind of wondering if we don't build another station like right up in here, but I'm concerned about having not enough mana now. Especially since it takes so stinking long to get to these towers. Oh, that thing just looked at it and it blew up. That was cool. Okay, we're going to go in... Uh, build a few more of these. Just how many? I don't know. Fine. I'll use all my money this round on them. Uh, what do I want? Oh yeah, death rate increase. That's more money. Or poison sprayers damage the shields. That's even a better choice right now. Okay, so we have 1700 mana. There's another one of these. Let's build it. No, let's not. Let's just upgrade this one. With all my coins right there. Go university. We got Robo Obi here. Robo Ogi Ogi. Ogi. Ooh, he's got three oohs in him. Wow, he's got so many hit points. He's also dead, so that's good news. Okay, I don't like it when they have bosses that do that to us, though. Can we, are we making it through this? Things are getting slowed down and dying, like, right at the last second. Do we need another one, or do we need more? Man, our mana supply is so good. I think we can build another one. I think we can build it, like, right in here. So it can attack both ways if something happens. Look at me using my thinker, like my my brain juice. Uh, bleeding enemies, extra attack. Ooh, destruction, crit. Yep. Okay, so right in here, we're gonna build this. Obelisk on the top should be able to hit everything around. Let's get a Tesla. How does that, that doesn't reach. We'll put that out here. Get poison sprayers in the way. Let's get a flamethrower in the way. That should reach both sides, so does that. Fumes. More damage to shields. Shredder in here too. We need some frost keeps. Okay, so it'll slow down there. It'll slow it in there. Cool. And I know those are all level ones, but if I get money here, we should be able to level them up. The biggest thing I'm focusing on is just keeping my mana alive. I really could upgrade this stuff too, which you guys are probably telling me to do. I could use like another obelisks right in here because some of these are really getting big and just have that obelisk only focus on shield because we are upgrading the, the obelisk to shields too. That actually worked pretty well. Just a few little things to kill. Good. How's this coming along? I'm fine with this. This boy is just zapping. He's doing the zap over there. Oh, that's so close. Oh, wow. Okay, we are getting the polygons now, and they are regenerating health. I feel like it's time to build up another base of this. Should we try to get an upgrade? Is that a boss? Nope, that's just a weird-looking walking tree creature. <laughs> Watch this guy. He's gonna get right next to it and <laughs> instantly ev evaporated. Let's do the slow but sure, though, because that increases the... I thought that said some other kind of crystal. Ooh, I like this. All right, shoot. I shouldn't have done that, because I was gonna build up an obelisk again. Yep. I wanted that with like a frost tower to slow everything down. What I want is to be able to attack both sides here. I'm just really concerned about everything just coming into here and attacking me. I haven't even looked at that other side, which I'm also concerned about because I need to upgrade this thing. Good news is we still have over 6,000 mana at every second, so we're not draining it down too quickly. Just this little bit extra right here, being able to attack backwards like this. 
Uh, that really softened it up coming over in this way. Oh, we have a chest here too. What kind of fun thing do we get in here? More burn damage? Absolutely. Nice. Okay, let's upgrade back here. I want this thing to be nearest to death. And at this point, it should be health. Putting all of my money into here. It's a big radius. It's at the end. So if anything makes it through, it should nuke it pretty cool. Pretty quickly. Oh, this is cool. All right, this is what I hate though. We have these stupid, like, cubes and they're the ones that destroy me every flipping time i play this game but the problem has always been that i run out of mana and i've done everything i can to not run out of mana today i just don't like that they teleport it makes everything so much slower okay i'm it's so tense to me i like how those ballistas have just been vibing the whole time they've just been hanging out here doing what they do best slowly leveling up they're the unsung unsung heroes you have to hit the like button if you like these if you don't you're a monster and you know what happens to monsters? We obliterate my death rays. Also this boy, this is the exact reason here why I built this up. Because I felt dinguses like that are gonna make it through. Oh, also there's a tree, let's sell that. $1,400 and you didn't even give me anything fun. Wouldn't it be cool if we got a forest? That'd be awesome right now. What is this death ray pointing at? He's shooting all of this. Oh, it's the marked. Interesting. Okay, we are getting a f some of the shapes are making it. Not too many of them, though. That one got marked and instantly taken care of, but the problem is they spawn other ones, and that's the hard thing. Okay, 10,000 money. I want to upgrade again, but I think since this thing goes here to the right, I'd be a fool not to yes. take this. Ooh, plus three yes. shields. Okay, that means let's do a poison sprayer here. I'm going to upgrade this to shield damage. I can do a slow tower too. I don't know what's going to be in here, so... It could turn immediately to the right and then we miss out on this. Let's also grab a shredder up here, just for funsies. And we're gonna have you target most health. Although most things have like shields and stuff. Oh wow, that is actually perfect. Okay, we have a big six cents boss here. I could put in a lookout and then I'll have you target the most health and then I'll have this guy go for the targeted again. So that's gonna single-handedly take out a really big, almost really big boss and it didn't quite take it out on its own, but it worked really well, and they're getting damage over time. So that's exactly what we can ask for, especially since it needs to come back along this thing anyway. Man is still in good position. I would like to upgrade in here to see what happens. How's it looking over here? I don't see anything happening back on that side, so we're cool. Could this be the run? Could this be the run, my friends? I don't even know. I'm feeling confident, but that's usually when I fail. All right, that wasn't hard. I mean, more crit chance of my, my poison sprayers. Or bleeding takes plus, ooh. Let's do the biochemistry. That sounds funner. Oh, and a treasure chest. Why is something dead there? Hmm, okay. Uh-huh. Yeah, we'll do this one. All right. I like this. I don't even know what to use it for. But now everything's bleeding, so we have that going for us. Slow it down, nuke it with the nuke beam. This is exactly what we need right here. That's looking very nice. I am concerned over here still, but not by much. Cause this thing's not even working yet. And I have like a whole buttload uh -huh, of money to spend on it. 37, that should be cool. It does work pretty quickly, but some of these teleporters are really annoying. Doesn't matter though, everything dies. Ooh, what's this one? Okay, we go blue to green, green dies. My goodness, something made it past the death tower of death. This guy is not in good shape either. All right, we're gonna have to follow this guy's life here. Ooh, that was a good hit. Beautiful. All right, I need, to, I need to level this one up, I think. And this guy didn't even make it to this tower, so this has not even been used yet. Oh, it just was used. So excited. I put a flame tower up here too. I'm gonna put it on most armor and then level the bejeebers out of this. Okay, level 18, taking out the armor. Sending the fire. Mana is still over 1600. It's never really going down because we do get mana back on every kill too. There's 3% of our total on every kill. That was 3% of 1,700. What's uh, 21 plus 30, 50, what, 510? No, 51. 51 back every time we kill something. And there's been a lot of killing. Speaking of which, this guy's annoying. But he gone. Oh, until he spawned a little weird clone thing of himself. But he gone, he's not gone yet. You guys just are not cutting it right now. I am disappointed immeasurably with you. Uh, Burn damage, wow. Okay, here's another idea. Why don't we put another frost keep right in here? So we have this one going, then this one going, and then this one going. We're slowing it down the entire time they're going around this corridor, and then this one's here. So they're slowed the entire time. 
just giving our guys just a bit more time to destroy everything. Because some of these things are super fast, too. Oh, no, a little green man just made it through. <laughs> dumb little green man. Why would you do this? Why did I level him up into that? That was dumb. That's okay. This guy's going to have fun with him. He's going to teleport right into the death ray. Aw, Sawblade with their win instead. Nope. Oh, never mind. There it is. Wow, the death ray was actually needed this time. I'm scared. These are mostly health damage, too. Um, we'll just wait. I might need to change that. Why are there so many things here? Oh, another boss. What do I get this time? Yep, we want this. Ooh. We want more arm damage to armor. Especially with this guy. He's a level 18. I mean, 20. He's doing so much armor damage now. This whole path is super strong. Okay, more damage to shields. Poison per second. Increase maximum by plus 100. Hmm, pandemic. We are doing a lot of poison. 180, my goodness. I'm gonna do another frost keep and another poison sprayer and another, I don't even know, is that a good idea? That's expensive. Let's just do that. I kind of want to expand on this one, but I don't. Also, I feel like this thing has just not done anything for me. I got plus one global health damage. Sure, use this one. We're gonna do my mage. I'm gonna waste all of my money. Oh, 10,000 gold funding fundraisers. Magic's 20s, plus 26%. We got three more levels left. If I can just get more damage to shields, I'm super pumped about that. All right, we got another like octahedron now. I'm not a fan of him. I'm gonna kill them all, every one of them. Even the green ones. All right, this isn't so bad. Yeah, we still have another whole station to get to. Nobody's made it anywhere on this path. They're just so slow. I really wish the forest tile would show up where there's like 15 trees on it that we could sell them and get even more upgrades. But no, we have to do things the old fashioned way. I just like flame throwing things to death. That would be a painful way to go. Or the death ray. That'd also be a painful way to go. Ooh, more scholarships. Yeah, more all, yeah, that one. I put in a lot of money right here. 26% chance. I don't know why. Ah, uh, 7,000. I need I need more over here. I'm scared about this whole situation. Marked. Let's just do... Uh-huh. All the money right here. I'll do... I did, I did one here. Are you proud of me? I changed it up for the first time in a decade. Oh, that guy just got wrecked. Why do I exist? You don't exist. I'm ending you. Okay, that works. That works really well. It's slow. It's painful. It's deadly. Everything here is just dying and not teleporting. I have 13,000 money. I don't, I'm honest. I don't know what to spend it on. The biggest issue, I feel like this is short, but I mean, this is already level 28 and this one here is level 37. Should we just go for it? Make an absolute nuke tower, 47? Sure. Oh wow, and there's the end of this tunnel. Interesting. The 12 really is the superior when you think, what does that even mean? Really is the superior base? Oh, base 12 instead of base 10. I, I math joke. My base is superior. Superior than all of these dorks. I think the strategy of having an insane amount of mana is definitely a good one because then you can make a big base and not have to worry about it. Six per second. Yeah, that works. Also, I feel like I wasted every single penny that I put into the research things. This level 47 tower is just going bananas. It's evaporating everything that comes by it. Ooh, ooh, something almost snuck away. Almost. It didn't though. Ooh, somebody did get away. You tell oh, just about. And his little friend came out. See, that's what I really don't like. These stupid teleporting things. There's a lot, man, frame rate actually dropped. I've got a 4090 in this thing. That's just a lot of particle effects happening in a little indie game. But the good news is if I can handle this way, then I just need to expand this path slightly. Oh, wow. Okay. So things are making it in. Interesting. Well, time to upgrade you, my little friend. We're going everything else into health because everything should be health related by the time you get here. Good, good. <laughs> it's like a bug zapper. I knew it. There would be a little shield, but it won't be much. So all of the little things got killed, but all of these stupid weird geometric shapes are still alive. They are making it very far. I need to upgrade this now. I don't even know what to upgrade it in because it's kind of everything at this point is kind of health. So why not? It's full cent. I mean, there are once they break down to another shape, they have a little bit of other stuff, but it should be pretty good. Yeah, that's insane. OK, it's doing super well. Good. We don't even have to worry about making it to the other one, which is a level 59 or something stupid. They have it dropped a niner in there or just a little one. Drop the Niner. These things still have stupid amount of hit points, though. My goodness. Look at that. 
It's dead though. Okay, more damage to armor. I feel like this is the best way to go. And is this the last level? Is 45 the last one? It is, look at that. We only had two tunnels, that's crazy. Usually they branch into like 79. Where's the bosses at? Do we get bosses? Oh, there's a boss. What is that thing called? Oogahedron. <laughs> Wonder what the dev's fascination with oogies is. I don't even know what an oogie is, other than like when somebody licks their pinky and puts it in your ear. It's a loogie. Oh, that's the spit. Ick, sorry. I'll just be done talking about stuff like that right now. And enjoy this. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna enjoy the microwave-vation of the enemies as they roll into my base, or attempt to. <laughs> my goodness. This fella's got so many hit points. Plus, it's a boss, so it's gonna split down into even more. But it has to go by this same one again if it doesn't get destroyed this time around. Every one of these ticks is a thousand hit points, too. Oh, there's a critical troll. Wow, there's two of them. I don't think that's gonna be an issue, though. Oh, there's a lot of stuff. Look at the frame rate. My goodness. You guys might not be able to tell, but I can. Okay. It works stupidly well. How are things going back here? Is anyone making it in? Not really. A couple of the green ones, but we still have a level bajillion over here that should take them care of them. And if it doesn't, I can still upgrade it. It's a level 30. Should be fine. Our mana supply. Ooh, I just saw 1500 for the first time. And if it doesn't kill them on this path, it'll still hit them on the other way. And this one is set to progress, right? Nope, nearest death. Okay, maybe I should set to progress. We'll set it to progress. Also, I could put a lookout over here and set that to progress. So anytime anyone gets close to it, it takes more damage. All right, where's the boss at? Do we get a boss? Oh, they're still up here. Dodeca Oogie. I, I am a little bit concerned about this now. I'm not sure why. Oh, a treasure chest. And don't mind if I'll take care of that one right before we leave. Um, my, no, we'll take that. Hey, Dodeca Oogie died. Oh, that split into two more. Weird. Oh, and then the two split into other two. They won't last too long. This little boy is, he is doing the absolute work back here. He's like, I want to get every bit of mana out that I can. Look at all those hit points there. Mike, I didn't realize I could zoom in that far. Okay, they're making it around the corner. This was never a big powerful area. This was mainly just made to slow things down. That's a level 15, 19,000. Almost everything has health. So we're just gonna nuke the health out of it. 39, yeah. <laughs> Nobody's gonna get by that tower anymore. My goodness, these death rays are so strong. Oh, it teleported, hey. It teleported. Take him out. Good job, buddy. Good job. It's like I'm talking to a cat. You're playing with your toy. Did you want snacks? Need a belly rub? Don't bite my fingers. I can't believe we did it. How many times have I played this game? How many episodes am I in on this game? That I have... Oh, there's an endless mode. My goodness. I don't even know how many times I've played, but that was by far the best one I've ever done. Look at all this damage from the obelisk. My goodness. I can't even read it. Monsters generated the most. Hmm, house protection, banditry. Quite a bit on banditry. Deforestation. I didn't lose, you can lose gold? Weird. The lookout did a lot of damage too. Why does the lookout, is that just the multiplier for the obelisk? And I kind of wonder what would happen with the, the particle cannon. You guys will have to let me know what you think of that, but we have 1700 XP to buy a whole bunch more of these. I still want to get all of them. Wow, there's so many things in here. Anyway, my friends, that'll do it for today. Hope you enjoyed this. I really did. I love this game. So keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Splatter Sax, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brett, Dalton C, Scatter D, Mr. Cripple One, Peyton Please, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Blank Hewitt, Tyler J, Nitro VR, Nitrox, Wyatt H, Otto Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippias, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Rittler Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Baxter, Ral, VC Engineer, Scars Marex, Spencer T, Whiskey, and YH. 